All right, welcome everybody. Welcome to our uh, welcome, welcome, welcome to our web viewers. We have quite a few of you, and I'm really happy that you're viewing on the web. Welcome to our live viewers, and welcome to, of course, you know, our replay viewers. You guys on the replay. Oh, let's see it's turned around there we go hey you guys in the replay have been really really great thank you thank you thank you for tuning in so hello so s-o-p-l-l-o -L -L -O. i don't know how to pronounce that but welcome 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 to the um periscope so i'm dr leticia wright and i teach people how to get fully fully funded in 90 days or less using the crowdfunding strategy. Hello Dallas44. Thank you for the hearts. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So using the crowdfunding strategy is what we focus on. Hello hometown boy. Welcome to uh, this uh, Periscope. Welcome to my Periscope. Um, we're going to do questions and answers. Um, crowdfunding has grown into one of the biggest, biggest ways to generate and create revenue uh, that people have seen. Last year, $35 billion changed hands. And um, I go around the country teaching people, especially people with businesses, how to use the crowdfunding strategy. So uh, you can find me at getcrowdfundednow.com, getcrowdfundednow.com. You can also find me on Periscope, Instagram, or Periscope, Instagram, or what's the third one? <laughs> Snapchat as Dr. Wright. One, Dr. Wright in the number one. Hello, K, K, I don't know what that says. K, K, hello with the pink hearts. Hello, hello. So um, that's where you can find me if you want to connect on, on social media. Of course, I'm on Twitter as Dr. Wright one also. And thank you for the hearts. Thank you for the pink hearts. So here's the thing. If you want to know more about crowdfunding and you want to get some more free information I'm teaching here every day, go ahead and subscribe. Subscribe and share with your friends. Swipe up or swipe down or swipe left or swipe right. Whatever you do, swipe. Invite your friends via Facebook. Invite your friends via Twitter. Because when you start crowdfunding, they are going to be the people that support you. So it's best that they know what the heck you're doing. You're right? It's better that they know what the heck you're doing. So when you crowdfund, it's all good. So uh, go ahead, invite your friends. Give me some hearts if I'm on track with what you need to know. And today we're going to talk about three, 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 three. Thank you for the hearts. Thank you for the pink hearts. That just lets me know you're on track. I'm not really like, I got to have a bunch of hearts. I just want to know that the information that I'm giving you is helping you. I want to know that this information is doing something for you. It makes no sense for me to keep teaching crowdfunding if nobody's getting it, nobody's doing it, nobody needs it. I'm here to help you. So that's how I know. So thank you so much. And thank you for the amen. I got my amen corner. Thank you for the, for the amen. So here's the deal. Here's three little known benefits of crowdfunding. If you're brand new to crowdfunding, what it is, is it is, hello, uh, Aron, Aroniel, Aroniel, whatever. Hello, <laughs> welcome. If you're new to crowdfunding, crowdfunding is raising money online using a website by taking gifts of money or investment money from different people. You get different amounts from different people. Kickstarter and Indiegogo and crowd, uh, go, I'm sorry, GoFundMe are just three websites. They are not crowdfunding. Crowdfunding is the thing that you are doing. Salud, salud. Uh, crowdfunding is the thing that you're doing. GoFundMe is a website that you do it on. The crowdfunding is something that you're doing Kickstarter is a website that you do it on. Crowdfunding is the thing that you are doing. Indiegogo is a website that you do it on. And those are the three biggest websites. There are actually 1,500 different websites you could be using to raise money. And so, I don't know about you, but it's very, very, I don't speak French. I'm sorry, I don't. <laughs> speak some other languages, but not too much French. Um, so, you have to, have to, have to understand how crowdfunding works. Thank you for the hearts, Ultra, Ultra Light B. Hello, Ultra Light B. Thank you for those beautiful red hearts. Um, you have to understand how crowdfunding works and what it works on and what it doesn't work on and how it works with what you're doing, if that makes sense. 
I hope that makes sense. So here's three benefits, secret benefits, benefits people don't think about when they're crowdfunding and some of the reasons why people are actually crowdfunding. Like some people are crowdfunding specifically for these reasons. Hello, Alicia, welcome. Um, crowdfunding specifically for these reasons, okay? So here's reason number one. If you're ready for reason number one, put a number one in there. We're talking about crowdfunding and we're talking about three little known benefits of crowdfunding. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, if you're ready, press a one and we will talk about it. We're talking about crowdfunding. If you're brand new and haven't subscribed, subscribe already. So hometown is ready. All right, hometown, this is just for you because you're the only one that said you're ready. Well, I can't be, that's not really fair. I am doing well. Thank you so much, 500. I, can, I just can't say you're the only one ready because the people, thank you, 500, for giving me one. The people who are watching on the web, I can't see their reaction. So if you're watching on the web, I can only interact with you if you're right here in Periscope with me. So here's the number one reason. It grows your list. Guess what? No matter what you do with crowdfunding, whether you win, lose, or draw, when you get done, the people who have given you money or asked you questions, you now have their contact information. They are now part of your list. They have given you permission to contact them. They become officially, officially part of your tribe. What exactly do I mean? I mean that when people go to your crowdfunding page and they go, okay, um, I'm gonna check this out and I'm gonna give some money, they have to put in all of their information. And when they do that, then, then, when they do that, you have their information. Or they may go to the page and say, I don't understand what's going on, I, I, I don't get this, and they want to ask you a question, or they want to ask you a question about when it will be, um, when it will be ready, when it will it be delivered. They want to ask you a question, you have their contact information. So the number one little known benefit is that you grow your list, literally, you grow your list and that's a great reason to crowdfund these people are interested these people have given you permission to talk with them they've given you permission to send them uh, emails they've given you permission to reach out to them so you've grown your list so that's a really important rule if you're ready for number two what's number two the number two little known benefit of crowdfunding. So give me a two for those of you if you're ready for the number two little known benefit for crowdfunding. If you're new, go ahead and subscribe. I'm Dr. Leticia Wright. I teach you how to get fully funded in 90 days or less with crowdfunding. I see your two. I see your two. Okay, we're ready. Number two, media attention. That's right. When you crowdfund, especially if it's super successful, you can get into the media. It's a reason to send out a press release. It's a reason for your local media to talk with you. It's a reason for your local media to feature you. Why would they want to feature you? Well, they want to feature you because they care about what's happening locally. So you might not get in USA Today, but you can get into your hometown paper when you send them some information and say, I'm crowdfunding for X, Y, and Z. Thank you for joining. Ooh, thank you for the thumbs up. Give me some hearts too. Let me know if that's helping you. Hello, Timmy. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for joining. Thank you for giving me the heart. So it is a great reason, a great opportunity to get your okay to get your you you and your project you and your project get you and your project into the media so crowdfunding is a great excuse to talk to the media talk to your friends that are writers talk to your friends that are bloggers radio tv whether it's online radio terrestrial radio which is what i call uh, what we have in the car, satellite radio, whether it is internet TV, uh, broadcast TV, cable TV, believe it or not, UHF is still out there. All of those types of stations will carry you, will want to talk about you if you have a crowdfunding project going on. So that's a little juicy bit. Number three, if you're ready for number three, uh, before I give you number three, I'm going to tell you where to get uh, a free guide. So the guide is called the resource guide for the top 25 crowdfunding sites. And the top 25 crowdfunding sites 
are sites that I've listed that I like to use and I tell you why I like to use them and you can check them out for yourself before you put your project up. So this, it, you can write this down, somebody can type this in the comments for me. You can text the word Perry, P-E-R-I, text the word Perry to 909 Bull. Media doesn't care about crowdfunding. Well, that's your opinion, but uh, I've done it over and over again and so, you know, that's that's what works. 909-906-9797. It's 909-906-9797. You can get the guide at 909-906-9797. So um, that's what you can do with crowdfunding. So here's the third reason. If you're ready for number three, here's a little known benefit of crowdfunding. Um, Here's a little, the number three benefit, give me a three if you're ready for the number three benefit in crowdfunding. You can pick up the guide, you can get some more information about crowdfunding. Uh, people have made $35 billion in crowdfunding, so maybe it didn't work for you because you don't know what you're doing, but I'm telling you, a whole lot of people have made a whole lot of money off of crowdfunding. So your perspective is, I guess, what you know, but I'm telling you guys, crowdfunding does work when you know what you're doing when you've taken some time to invest in it instead of just throwing something up and telling somebody to give me uh, pay my rent for me when it's something really good when it's a great project that helps other people it does really well so here's number three give me a number three if you're ready for the number three little known benefit in crowdfunding the little known benefit in crowdfunding honey there's evidence everywhere there's studies everywhere I'm sorry that you're really unhappy but there are studies everywhere that show how much money happened in crowdfunding I'm sorry you don't believe in crowdfunding I don't know what made your life really horrible but uh, you know in this broadcast it's about teaching if you don't like crowdfunding if you don't think crowdfunding is good then don't be in this broadcast what are you doing here I don't have to give you any examples you can go online and google how much money transcribed went in different hands in crowdfunding okay I don't have to give you anything you can go to Google and find it I don't have to provide it for you so well no but you can you can take a hike you can take a hike here's the thing if you don't want to be here in the broadcast don't be here in the broadcast it's too bad that people have a horrible life and they want to come into your broadcast and want to disturb everybody else but here's the deal this is my house <laughs> so go find somebody else to mess with Okay, so the other, the third thing that's really great about crowdfunding is that you can find out what else people want. For example, if you are putting together a book, if you are putting together uh, a new invention, you can find other things that people want because they'll ask you for it. They'll say, hey, does this come with X, Y, and Z? And that might be a feature um, how do you know if crowdfunding is right for me? I have a travel team and a new print company, um, or new printing company. It can be right for you, but it depends on what types of crowdfunding. You have to remember that it's not just the Kickstarter type of crowdfunding. You might be ready for investors. That's crowd equity. That's a different type of crowdfunding. So it just depends on what, what's going on with your company and what you're, what you're doing. You guys have to remember the six types of crowdfunding, and your company probably um, fits into one of them. So you got to figure out what you're going to do and you know how it's going to work. So it can work for you, but it might not be the Kickstarter type of crowdfunding. So you just need a little more information. For those of you that just found out about crowdfunding, it, you know, it takes a little bit of a learning curve. Um, you don't want to just jump out there and throw something up on Kickstarter because it might not be the right thing for you. But anyway, the third, the third thing that I was talking about is that you could find out other things that people need other things that people need. In other words, if you're writing a book, they might ask you, hey, is there a course going with this? You can take that information and say, hmm, lots of people are asking for a course. I need to make that. You can figure out the other products that go with what you're doing. So crowdfunding can be a great opportunity. Um, if you don't know what you're doing, it can be a big crash and burn, and it can make your life miserable. But Crowdfunding has been very, very good for millions of people around the world, and uh, I'm happy to share it with you. Get the free guide. Watch the, watch the replay if you didn't get it. Get the free guide. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm here Monday through Thursday, so you can subscribe and you can pick it up. Have a great day, and ciao for now.